So the only realistic ways that the man in the middle could bypass this warning and go unnoticed is if they have already exploited you or your machine by either social engineering or maybe some malware that's going to secretly install their certificate into the client's certificate authorities list, right? But to think that this attack just happens is overlooking many earlier stages where you could have taken steps to protect yourself. Now, if you're looking at this and you're like, man, that's like so devious, right? That's so smart. Let me point out to you that this is the same process that's used in legitimate organizations when they're trying to monitor their employees' web activity, right? So let's say this is Bob, and Bob's supposed to be working on his TPS reports, but instead he goes to Wikipedia. His browser will start a TLS handshake with the organization's proxy. The proxy will start its own TLS handshake with Wikipedia's web server. Wikipedia's web server will send back a certificate and public key. The proxy will intercept it and send its own certificate and public key. Now at this point, Bob's browser will not trust the proxy certificate and let Bob know that his online activity is probably being monitored, right? So to avoid this, the organization will install the certificate to Bob's browser, basically making the connection seem normal. But in fact, all traffic is being intercepted and monitored by the proxy. Now, notice that this process, again, was the same process that we saw when we were looking at our attacker example, right? The only difference in these two was the intent and the consent, right? Bob probably signed some some like waiver when he got hired that his online activity would be monitored. So he agreed to it. And the organization's intent was simply to protect their workplace from bad actors and increase employee productivity, right? So I bring this up because in cybersecurity, you may learn things that don't seem so exciting or maybe not relevant to ethical hacking. And I want you to see that there are gonna be some wax on, wax off exercises that you may not realize you just learned how to fight or even defend yourself. 